Uh, I'm Andy Holsclaw with uh, Stillwater Outdoors. This is my story of my pheasant hunting trip. It all started about 22 years ago. I was fresh out of high school and I, uh, I got a dog. My, my brother got a couple dogs. My dad got a dog. We all decided we were gonna go out to South Dakota pheasant hunting and um, just kind of took off. We, we loved it. Uh, we'd go out there at least twice a year, sometimes go down to Iowa, sometimes South Dakota. You know, so we did it for probably eight years and uh, dogs got old and uh, dad got sick and we just didn't go out there anymore. Fast forward uh, this past April, my dad passed away and uh, it really kicked off things, making me think a lot about pheasant hunting again and how I want to share that with my son. So I, I picked up a dog and I got this little puppy and I went out for the first time with, uh, with my wife earlier in the year. and. When I started thinking about going back out to South Dakota, I, I have a friend that I work with that uh, his family owns some land. It's around Millbank, South Dakota. He said that I could go out there and check it out. He's never really hunted it before, and, but he said he thinks it'd be good. So I went out there and right off the bat, just seen birds and Howie, this Brittany is just phenomenal. And I had to go back out there again. So this time I was gonna bring Shane with and um, I wanted to get footage. Going into this hunt, I didn't really know what to expect, but I did realize if you go there, you do need to be in good shape because it's tough. I loved hanging out with my dogs and stuff. It was really fun. I'd do it again. First day, just got out to Russ's property and uh... Got the GoPro hooked up, ready to go. Shane's gonna see what hunting's all about here. Yeah. See if we can get Howie on some birds. Let's go. I'm gonna walk down that way. Okay. Oh, really? Oh wow. She brought 30 out of six. No. <laughs> That's a nice buck. Oh, oh, dude, that's a nice buck. Yeah, was. Wow, that was awesome. That's what I'm talking about. What? Oh, it's a coyote hole. Could have been an ankle breaker right there. Oh man. Oh, man. <laughs> oh, Dad. Deer or something been bedding in here. Yeah, they have been. Dad, I can barely walk. Oh. Ooh. Yeah. Ben, that a boy. He was on something. Oh, oh shoot. Hen. Lots of hens in here. How we must flush that? Oh, I came out from over there. He's got cattails in his mouth. Yeah. Ooh. Ah. Dang.
Hen. Good boy. Good boy, Hen. Hen. That a boy. Nice buck. Nice buck. Holy, Holy running right at us. How he come? Crap. That's a, that's a nice Holy crap. Holy wow. Man. You got that on video? Yeah. Oh. I thought that thing was coming at me. I'm like, oh yeah, let's go. Hey, that one was a mounter, I think. Yeah. That's a nice one. Not from this year though. Probably last year. Yeah, probably last year. Shoot, can we put this in the back of yours? Alright, come on buddy. We're gonna walk this over to the fence line, walk that fence line all the way down, and back over. You stay over here, right along the fence line. I'll be over here. Moo. Moo. Pen. Good boy. You're on him, aren't you? a boy. Get that thing on the shoulder. There might be another one here. Pretty cool though, huh? Walk right through that grass there, Shane. No? Come here. Come here. <laughs> Good job. <laughs> Even on him. No, I wasn't. That's all right. It's all right. Hey, how dog? That a boy? That a boy? Come here. Get up there, Shane. Hen. Are you on them? Up on this corner is where I, I didn't get the shot at that rooster. Oh, there goes a rooster right there. Yeah, well, that's a long ways out. Hey! Rooster! Too far out. That was on Howie right there. Oh, we got
That a boy. Good boy. Come here. Hey, come. Good boy. Good boy. Okay, drop. Go get the other one. Go get the other one. Good boy, all right. <laughs> that a boy. That a boy. Okay, drop. Drop. Good boy. Good boy. <laughs>